it is given that the velocity of transverse wave in a stretched wire is 100 meter per second. So, velocity is given as 100 meter per second. If the length of the wire is doubled and the tension in the string is also doubled. If the length of wire we increased from L to 2L and tension in the string is also doubled. Tension is changed from T to 2T. And our aim is to find out the final velocity of transverse wave and the wire S. So, we know the equation for velocity of wave that is V is equal to under root of T divided by mu, where mu is nothing but linear mass density. So, this mu we can take it as nothing but mass per unit length. So, over here if you are stretching the string without changing the mass of that string, then there will be some change in value of mu. So, in this situation we are not uh, stretching it, we just use another length L addition over here. So, mass is also increased by let us say 2 times and length is also increased by 2 times. So, the linear mass density will remain a constant. So, we can write in this situation this V is directly proportional to root of T. So, we can write velocity in second case by velocity in first case is equal to nothing but under root of tension in second case which is 2T divided by tension in first case which is which we can take it as T. So, you can write the value of this uh, V2 divided by initial velocity 100 is equal to nothing but uh, a root of 2 which is equal to 1.414. So, you can write the value of velocity V2 is equal to 141.4. So, in this type of question you need to be uh, care about the uh, words which is given in the question. Sometimes in question they will give it as the wire given wire is stretched to a length of 2L. So, if it is stretched that means we are keeping the mass constant and we are increasing the length so that the linear mass density will also change. If you are keeping m constant and if you are changing the value of L then linear mass density will change or if you are just using additional wire then mass will also increase and length will also increase so that linear mass density will remain same. 